What is up, y'all, and welcome back to Queen Michelle. We're on the channel. Y'all know we talk about fashion, beauty, and life. And today, I am bringing y'all a she in try on, honey. So, before we get started, I'd like to thank all of my subscribers. Special thank you to the ones that watch the entire video, share my videos, thumbs the video up, and leave comments. Special thanks to y'all. Shout out to all of my subscribers, actually. Um, but y'all do know I am putting together some things, so just stay tuned to the channel. I keep reminding y'all because it is coming soon, but I like to do things in a certain order and have things pretty much, you know, as planned out as possible. So, I just remind y'all on every video pretty much. Stay tuned to the channel. Make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend about Queen Michelle. Also, do not forget to shop queenmichelleinc.com. Um... Yeah, so let's just get right into it. Y'all, I got good energy today. I'm feeling really good today. Um, just a good just a good day, just for whatever reason. So I got up this morning, I'm like, let me go ahead and get this haul together. I mean, we'll just try on to the haul together. Um, because I know I did get three packages back to back. So here we are. And we're just gonna jump right into it with this first dress. Y'all, this dress is giving thigh. <laughs> y'all know I'm loving, loving, loving these dresses with these thighs. Even though y'all know my legs are really short and my thigh is little. But this dress is giving thigh, honey. I really like this. I do like the color. It is different. Um, it definitely, it only has the one split as y'all can see. Um, but this definitely is a cute fall piece. This is a thin, not necessarily sweater material, but it is like um, a thin kind of cotton material, but it is, it kind of gives you the sweater illusion. This is very, very comfortable. I love this little color. Of course, it is long sleeves, and this one actually is a good long sleeve. Um, for me, it's not too long, which is actually great. But y'all know I wear a watch every day, and most of the times I wear a bracelet. So I love to record a link or just pulling it up so that you can see, you know, the watch or the bracelet if I have it on. Um, I just have on a, well, I'm not doing a, a full to get ready. Y'all know I wear my basic jewelry, so let me just stick to what we're doing here. Um, give y'all a full 360. I absolutely love the thigh out on this dress. Really cute. And I actually like that it's a different cut with the thigh out. It's not just the normal split where you got to kind of make the thigh come out or it comes out while you walk. This thigh is just out on this dress. Um, this is the back, really simple, just, you know, straight down. The lines are also um, vertical, straight up and down. This is a really, really cute dress. And to be quite honest with y'all, I will wear this in the spring. I wouldn't wear it in the summer so much because it's just a little bit too warm for summer, but I would wear it in the spring where it's kind of chilly some of them days because I can see me wear some sandals or something with this, but I would wear some kind of like, um, maybe a canvas shoe, a van, or some kind of little dainty shoe like that, something like that maybe with this, but I definitely would, definitely would wear sandals with this dress as well. So this is a versatile piece for me, but y'all, that is this first cute dress. Okay, so now we have this dress. Now y'all know this dress just puts me in the, in the mind of a lion for whatever reason. I think it's just the, I, the way this looks like uh, maybe a lion's, what they call it, a mane or the hair, whatever it is. Um, this dress puts me in the mind of it for whatever reason. And that's just what I saw when I initially saw this dress. Um, I do love the colors on this dress. Definitely fall or winter. Definitely knee boots. Um, maybe a Ugg. I'm not really sure. Ugg may not get this any justice, but I really think a knee boot. Maybe a booty or something like that. But I really think this would be full on winter. Just because of the colors and the style of it for whatever reason. It is like a mock neck. I like that about it. Um, it's not real tight on the neck, which is absolutely good because I don't really like nothing choking me up. Um, love the colors. Of course, I'll give y'all a full 360. 
It's also a good length. It is a, just a wee bit short, but I still will wear this out somewhere, maybe to some kind of get together where, you know, you dressing up and all of that. Really cute. Love that it actually is fitted, fitted like a true body kind. Um, I could have stood to go up. I think this is a 3X. I could have really got a 4X. It would have gave me just a little bit more room. And the well, the length is okay, but it would have gave me a little bit more room because this is one of the kind of dresses where when it stretches a lot, the color does kind of stretch with it. So if I would have went up um, to the 4X, I believe was the biggest size, that would have been better for the actual stretching of it. But I still don't think it looks bad. I think it looks cute and it still gives you the same illusion that it was given. Absolutely love this simple little dress. Real cute. Um, I could see this on a date depending on where you're going. But I more so see this just on a regular outing. You want to be cute. Something like that. I wouldn't necessarily wear this on a date. But you could. But that is this cute dress. So now we have this one piece. Y'all, I love my one pieces. Y'all do know that. Um, Y'all do know I'm loving brown more and more. Never was one of the colors I would gravitate towards or anything like that, but coming out of my comfort zone, I decided to go ahead and just try it. Absolutely loving brown on my skin, y'all. I never thought I would like brown so much, but actually love it. This one piece is so comfortable and just cute. Y'all know I would dress this up. I would dress this down. I would wear sandals, tennis shoes, Uggs, knee boots. I mean, you could do whatever with this. You can do some heels. This is a piece that you really really can dress any type of way you want to love that it is a neutral color and y'all i'm just i really really like this now y'all know i do have a tan one like this and i'm actually going to go um look on Shein after a while and get all of the colors in this one this is in the basics y'all I don't know if y'all know, but Shein does have an area that's called like um, basics or essentials, something like that, where it's stuff like this, all solid colors, t-shirts, leggings, dresses, and jumpsuits and stuff like that. This came from that area, and I do believe it said basics. Um, I'm going to go and get all of the colors in this particular jumpsuit because this actually fits better than the ones I get in Rainbow. And where have I gotten other ones like Burlington and stuff like that? This fits the best for whatever reason. I absolutely love the fit. And y'all see me pulling it up just because I was just adjusting it to make sure it's right. I love the coverage at the front. It does have adjustable straps. Of course, I'll give y'all a full 360. Just, excuse me, a basic jumpsuit. But it fits really, really good. I love this. I would wear this with jean jackets, a sweater over it. I mean, you really can do a bunch with this. And the brown, it's just giving. It's just giving. It's definitely saying fall and winter. That is for sure. And y'all know y'all can color block with brown. You can do some navy blue. You can do tan. You can do white, black. This is a really, really good neutral color and just a really good piece to have because y'all have seen me dress these one pieces up with um, button down shirts, denim jackets. Well, I don't really know if I've done a denim jacket yet, but I will do a denim jacket look with a jumpsuit. But you can really do so much with these jumpsuits. Absolutely in love. Okay, so we are back. Y'all know that I do have the same exact dress in a spaghetti strap with a split on the side. I got that dress at Burlington, but when I seen this dress on Shein, I actually got this because for one, I love the cut on it. I'm into the um, little strings hanging out and then the ruching on the sides. Absolutely in love with that. But y'all know I'm into dragons right now. For whatever reason, when I just saw that one dress that's just like this, 
I was like, I don't know about dragons because I tried the dress on in Burlington before I actually bought it. So I was like, I don't know about dragons, but when you put it on, it just really brings it to life and give it a whole nother look. Stuff can look crazy off, but when you really put it on and you style it and stuff like that, it can really bring the piece to life. So y'all, if y'all see something that's random, because to me, dragons are not really weird, but they weren't really my thing. You know, I wasn't really into that kind of thing. But seeing it on, putting it on, and styling it and stuff like that, it just really brought it to life. And now I'm in love. Absolutely love this print. My other dress is black and white, just like this one, but it is a different um, cut of dress. But I just had to get it again, y'all. Love the t-shirt dress. Um that this is giving crew neck so it's really a basic cut and again the sides and stuff like that just really adds an extra little piece of jazz for me i really really love that love the length y'all know i like the length a little bit above the knee or a little bit um below the knee i'm fine with that absolutely love this i would do anything in this dress i would definitely dress this um up or down and for me Dressing it up would just mean I would carry a more um, jazzy bag or something like that. And then, of course, wear a heel that would give it a different look. Dressing it down, I would do a fanny pack or a sporty kind of purse or something like that. So that it just give it that everyday look or whatever. So really, it's the accessories that will make this be dressy, dress up or dress down, you know, that will give it that look. But I get both the dress up and dress down vibe from this real heavy. Absolutely love this dress. It's very comfortable. I could definitely run errands in this and just really do basic stuff in this every day. Y'all know I love functional pieces as well. That is my go-to thing, being comfortable and cute. It's good to be dressed up and really, you know, do it and whatever else. But my main thing is to be comfortable. That's just my get down. That's what I like. And I love to be cute as well. This dress gives me that dress up and dress down vibe. So I, I'm rocking with this. But y'all, that is this cute dragon dress. Okay, y'all. So now we are back with this cute olive dress. And y'all, I am feeling this dress. This is somewhat different. Now, it is a basic cut to me and all of that. Absolutely love olive on my skin as well. That's also a color I never really wore as much until like now. Absolutely love the color on me. Love that this dress has a zip functional uh, zipper. So it can be like a mock neck or whatever if you wanted it like that. Or you can definitely unzip it and show some boobs as I would. Um, really, really cute. Absolutely love the um, cut. And y'all, this has the thumb things cut in it. Now, it is a little bit long for me because this is the dress. I mean, well, the sleeves like out on me. I don't necessarily like how long this is, so I actually might get this cut just a little bit in the head, you know, around, so it can be shorter for my arms and everything. So I just folded it back for the video. So if it was shorter, it would be perfect for me, but I absolutely love this. I don't have anything with like the thumbs cut out so you can wear it like that. That gives it that sporty look. Absolutely gorgeous. I would definitely dress this up or down as well. Like I said, love the zipper. You get the option of showing some boobs. Love that. I will give y'all a full 360. Really cute. Also, it is rib and it is stretchy, but this is one of those control kind of stretches. Absolutely love things like that because it just makes you look smoother or it helps with looking smoother. Um, y'all know I do wear shapewear like most of the time when I wear dresses and jumpsuits and stuff like that. That's just to look smooth. So that's my preference. Absolutely love this. And like I said, it is like a control stretch. So it is stretchy, but it does kind of have that good little, you know, control. It kind of clings to the curves and everything like that. 
absolutely love this. I would definitely dress this up or dress this down. I could see this definitely with tennis shoes, some kind of little slip on sandal, anything like that. Um, I do wear long sleeves and shorts and stuff like that in the summer. So I will wear this in any season because some my arms get cold faster than my legs anyway. But I definitely will wear this just whenever I feel like it. Like I said, any season, I would do a UGG. I, would, I wouldn't do a knee boot, I don't think, just because of the texture of the dress. I can't picture a knee boot with it, but it could just be because I don't have it on or something like that. And that's another thing, y'all. I always tell y'all kind of what I picture right in the moment. Because sometimes when I see some on, I have to recant what I said because it actually does look right. So y'all don't take nothing like that to heart. Uh, when I'm up here, I'm just really like straight off the dome, what I'm feeling in the moment, what I'm thinking in the moment, and how I can picture some in that moment. So right now I can't see this with a knee boot. But if I put a knee boot on and it flows and it goes, then it's a go. Also, y'all know if y'all like something, if you put it on and you like it, regardless of what any fashion person say or whatever it is, if you feel good in it, wear it. You know what I'm saying? So I just want to make that be known because a lot of times I just tell y'all my opinion. Well, really all the time I tell y'all my opinion and the way I feel or the way I think some, you know, could be. But like I said, when you see something on or you get your own, like, oh, I think the XYZ would look right with this. Or I think, you know, this and that. Just go with it. Try it on. Play in your clothes. See what you like. See how you feel. Because everything I wear, I have to feel comfortable in it. And I have to feel confident. Because people can tell when you wear things that you do not feel confident or you don't feel you know good people can kind of feel your energy and pick up on it yeah i don't want to preach or nothing like that but um in my earlier videos i always used to you know say some kind of uplifting message and stuff like that i'm gonna try to get back into doing that because i really think that is beneficial and that's really what i'm here for because you know sometimes when you plus size you get the feeling because i was one of the people that i would have never put on a crop top um probably not even worn body con and then i just started trying stuff because i love fashion i always have loved fashion but i was limiting myself and now that i haven't been limited like i'm really really deep in now like i just get whatever i like you know what i'm saying and i put it on and i i haven't even had anybody really come for me like i thought people would maybe um, but my sister always said, girl, you think too far into stuff, you know, whatever, whatever. That's my, you know, personality or whatever. But y'all, long story short, wear what you like. Feel good with your decision. I have had a couple of people tell me that they did go outside of the comfort zone and they feel good about it. So that's, that's what's up. That's what I'm here for, you know, so y'all. Stay tuned because I plan to bring y'all different things. And I even try stuff just out of my comfort zone for y'all. Just like the other day, I did those dresses with the cutout stomach. I never wore anything like that. Put it on and I loved it. So y'all don't limit yourself. Go for what you know and just be in love with self, honey. But that is this cute dress. Okay, y'all, so we are back with another cute dress. Y'all, I'm feeling this color. I don't know if this color, I wouldn't call it gray. It's more of a, well, it isn't a gray family, of course, but this is like a metallic gray or something like that. Absolutely love this color. Gray is not one of my favorites, but I do love this shade of gray because it is dark. I, I love this, this, yeah, I love this. This is also my second dress that's like this, but not this color. I do have this dress in, I want to say tan or, or olive green. I can't really remember, but it is on one of my more recent videos because I love the way the dress fits. So I went ahead and got it in another color. Absolutely love the um, cut on it. Like I said, a little, a little bit above the knee and a little bit below. Absolutely gorgeous. Love off the shoulder. I will wear my bra just like this 
or with um probably two bandos to kind of give me a little bit of support but i don't think the bra straps actually look bad because it could have straps with the dress but you also could wear a denim jacket or some kind of sweater or something over this if you didn't necessarily want the top part to show um so i i love this you definitely can dress this up or dress it down and y'all i got this tag because this says she in basics so, and on the back it says back to the basics. So, this is also from the same um, line from where the um, brown jumpsuit came from. So, y'all go get these pieces because, like I said, you can color block with all of them. Most of them are neutral colors. Really, pro well, I would say all of them because they do have, like, some pinks and stuff like that. But most of them are neutral colors where you can color block really easily and do whatever with them absolutely love these of course i'll give y'all the 360. so this is definitely i will wear this on a date night i will wear this honey shopping grocery shopping bowling playing cards <laughs> whatever you do i think this is really really comfortable and you'll be comfortable all day in it i love the sleeves it's not too long for me y'all know my arms are really short I would three quarter length, quarter length it or wear it long sleeve. So I absolutely love it both ways. Really, really cute. Definitely would wear some kind of um light color. Like what if, good job. What if I did something like this? You know, something really loud with this color to just kind of bring it to life. So y'all, you really can just really do whatever you want with basic colors and really bring them to life. And of course, your shoe will match your bag, something like that. But y'all know I'm also going shopping here soon to get some new purses and some new shoes because I want to bring y'all some kind of different looks and stuff like that. Also, I'm going to show y'all this card just so y'all can go and see what I'm talking about. Hopefully, it focus. Okay, there we go. So she in basics and then it just says back to basics on the back. So y'all go check out that line on she in. And y'all know she in never really disappoints. Like I've had a couple of things literally um, that I didn't really care for that came from she in. Other than that, I'm in love with she in. This is like a forever company for me, y'all. Seriously. I mean... You can get jeans. Well, the jeans didn't work out for me. But y'all know I still gave them a good review on the jeans because they were good quality. And if you are smaller than me, then it will work out for you. And it was good, you know, good, good material. It wasn't like really cheap jeans or anything like that. And they were decently priced. So even if I can't fit some, I'm going to give y'all the real because it, it may just not be for me. But like I said, if you're smaller or taller or shorter or whatever it is you can kind of get you know some kind of understanding by looking at me because i'm short and big so if you taller than me you can kind of determine okay she got a three x i probably can do the one you know something like that so y'all just take what you need from the video and leave the rest but thumbs the video up and make sure you subscribe um also tell a friend to tell a friend about Queen Michelle because I give y'all the best advice that I have. I give y'all the real as far as what I experienced with clothes and all of that stuff. If I can't fit it or whatever it is, I tell y'all that. You know what I'm saying? So just make sure y'all bells are checked so that y'all get all of my videos and notifications and all of this stuff like that. So I got some things planned that's going to be new to the channel. So y'all just keep in touch. Stay here with your girl because I bring y'all the goods. I bring y'all everything that I know. Um, also some cooking videos and all of y'all know how I do. Um, but nevertheless, honey, that is this cute dress. Absolutely gorgeous dress, y'all. Okay, y'all. So now we have the only top that I did get from Shein. Now y'all know I did try this top in just a blue color, and I absolutely loved it. But it just was not staying like put right here, 
and it was that one is a different shape from this one y'all i'm in love with this top now this is something definitely way 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 out of my comfort zone and y'all i just rolled my shapewear down so y'all can just see the top because i feel like going to get no leggings and doing all that but um this top is actually really gorgeous i love the color blocking of it and i did purposely get brown because that's the you know season and the time we in love that it's like a caramel with like a chocolate and then the black is just like the main piece absolutely love that i do love this piece right here because it is like a little uh plastic bone in it right here and it is staying put so i absolutely love that um i think it could do a little bit more lifting um this one is a 3x the blue one was a 4x so maybe if i get another one i'll try 2x to see if it you know will hold up just a little bit more but i'm not disappointed with this at all i actually do love this um also let me give y'all a full 360 of it because the cut is really really good for plus size love how the back is and it does cover enough so I absolutely love that and love how the straps are as well. And also I'm really thinking um, that I could just get my niece to really make the straps a little bit tighter. You know, like cut some of the material and make it a little bit tighter to bring it up. And I really felt the same way with the blue one. I think it can be altered and I think that's what I am going to do. But this one is okay. It's better than the blue one. But I do feel like it can be just a little bit more lifted. Yeah, I think if it was more lifted, kind of like this, I think that would be a better look for me. Um, because the other way is just a little, because these ain't sitting up back without a real bra. It just ain't gonna happen. Um, but if you heavy chest and honey, and yours are real, you know what it is. Um, but I like I said, I don't think this one is bad. It is better than the blue one. Um, the blue one was a little more, it was a little more lax. And then the fact that on the blue one, this piece did not stay up. So it didn't really give it that, that look. But like I said, I think they both can be altered. This is a really, really cute top. This is not for the week, honey. So if you wear this, you need to be ready for what could be said, especially if you plus size. You need to be ready for what could be said or whatever. But for me, honey, I just can't worry about it because they just better hope I'm in a good mood when they say whatever if something gets said. <laughs> but, y'all, that is this cute, cute top. Absolutely love the color. And like I said, I just really love it up more like this. I think that's really a good look. I think I'm going to get the straps cut to just give it that more, you know, held up look. But y'all, this is my last piece as well. Also, y'all know how I do. Honey, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend about Queen Michelle. And y'all gonna be like, girl, you really was chatty in this video. I am a talker, y'all. But when I do my videos, I'm, you know, filming by myself. So I don't really have a conversation with myself. But I am a talker. I am thinking about going live. I just, I don't know if I want to go live and then like it ain't enough people in there. I really don't know how to feel about it. I done a couple of polls on it, but I still haven't went live. But I think I might do it one day soon. Who knows? But y'all know how we do. We are out.